All right, so I'm back at the fan storage. I just got back from Advanced Auto Parts after getting this car battery recharged completely. And I also got this little car fan in a sense, since I found it there. I've never seen them in stores before, so I figured why not? Definitely quite a workout walking back and forth with this car battery. It's always a good 50 pounds. So um, place isn't that far. It's like maybe five minutes away for us to walk there normally, five to 10 minutes. But place it's, it's like a good 20 to to 25 minutes walk, but with this heat, it's definitely good since it'll get me sweating more and so I have some of the gym's clothes during the pandemic. It's a good workout, so it makes up for it. But yeah, let me go ahead and get the car battery back in here so I can get the fans powered up again. All right, so I got power back and the fans are running again. Now I do just have the two back ones on only because I actually don't know what happened to the adapter piece that I can use to power up all four of them. But I am going to be mostly working in that back area to begin with today while I wrap up some of the blades. So I figured I'd just run those two since those are the two actually that get used the least so far. So I figured I'd let those ones break in a little bit. Especially that third one right there since that one's a bit stiff still. But also since it's not too hot today, I really don't need all four of them running. So I figured I'd just use two of them so that way I don't drain out the battery again quickly and such. But yeah, today is basically going to be mostly... Same thing as the other vlog that I did here where I was rearranging stuff. Um, just going to be finishing up wrapping up some of the blades and blade arms with the plastic wrap since I found that as it was buried underneath some stuff. And um, just rearranging stuff, finding, clearing up some space on here so I can bring some more motors and put them on these two shelves here. Because I can fit more fans on this shelf. It's just I have a lot of stuff there like the blades and such that are taking up the space that because I didn't want to have them on the floor where they'd get damaged and such. But also I think it's a bit hot and it's also not too hot today. It would also be good to only have two of them on that way I can sweat more and kind of use this as a workout in the sense since the gyms are still closed and haven't reopened yet. All right, so I got some of the blade arms wrapped up and the blades as well. I am just putting the rest of them back over here because I actually am starting to run out of plastic wrap where I won't even have enough Trap up another set of blades and blade arms. See, there's basically nothing left to it, so I wouldn't even even be able to wrap up like three blades and such. So I'm just gonna stop the wrapping up and focus on something else. We gotta get all the little papers that was all over the place, the plastic wrap, all of that packing type material in these bags. Because I'm really trying to get rid of these boxes that were brought over here. Um, I was holding some from Brandon, but um, Brandon let me know that he didn't need them all. So I'm just going to be breaking down the ones that are not in the best shape and save the bigger ones for him if he needs them. Same time of doing that, I did clear up some space here so it's not as messy looking. And I did find that little outlet adapter so I can power up the other fans. Now it isn't too hot here, but I think I just turned them on just so I can cool down a bit because I am a bit tired and moving around a lot of stuff in this heat. But um, yeah, I'm going to head out to Walmart and get some more plastic wrap and I'll pick it up next time I'm here. So I'll add more to this video there, but for tonight's portion, that'll be it. But um, it's not gonna be it for this video, but um, I'll pick it up another day when I get back here with some more plastic wrap. So now that I don't have any more plastic wrap, I'm gonna have to end it for tonight. And then um, after I come back tomorrow, possibly with some more plastic wrap, I'll finish up the blades. And then hopefully go to Home Depot afterwards and get another shelf like this to put in this area right here. Now with that being said, I may head home tonight and then I'll pick it up tomorrow. Alright, so it's the next day and I'm back at the fan storage. So as you can see, I got the plastic wrap at Walmart and a small one as well. So since I had a time, I created some space on the shelves yesterday. I figured I'd bring some more fan motors over and some bins of blade arms and such and some blades so that way I can have more stuff moved out of the apartment and into the fan storage. All right, so I got a lot more blades wrapped up and put into this bin here. So I got some of the, more of the blade arms wrapped up and put in the, to these two bins as well. There's a few sets of blades lying around that I have not wrapped up and, and it's for two reasons. One of which is that I still plan to test the fan that those blades go to. So I'm, I'd rather leave them assembled for the most part. And also some of them have a lot of dust that I'm gonna need to like a damp cloth to get it off. So I'd rather clean them off properly first before wrapping them up. For the, one of which being the blades for the Hunter Brentwood, which the top was never really cleaned that much. So obviously I'd, I'd rather clean it off properly 
But um, at the same time, that is one that needs to be retested anyway. So I figured I'd leave them out. But just take them off so I can give them a good cleaning. But yeah, now with all these blades basically put over here for the most part. What I'm going to be doing next time I'm here is getting the final shelf I need over in this area. So that way I can bring the rest of the fans from the apartment and bring them over here. Because while I do have some spots here and there on some of the shelves to put more motors, I'd rather not overcrowd them because... I do need some like space to move some stuff around. So I'll kind of use some of the free spaces on the shelves to put stuff on. So I'm just gonna get them on the floor. And I also still need to get um, the adapter pieces for this small shelf so I can assemble it completely again and such. So I can have like, some of the glassware on the top shelves here. But um, yeah, I didn't get, not as much as I would have wanted to today because I kind of was mostly working on doing little things here and there. For example, like I was doing the blades today, wrapping the blades up, wrapping up some more of the blade arms. Also was placing some of the fan motors from that I brought from home on certain shelves. Certain ones um, are here because they still actually need to be tested, but for the most part, what I'm gonna be bringing here is stuff that is not in the most pristine condition that I'm, I'm not gonna keep it at the house, but if it's like basically mint, I'm gonna keep it there. Or if it's a fan that's very, very sentimental to me. But if it's especially a fan that's very common and such, then I'm just going to bring it over here. At the end of the day though, basically almost all the fans from my apartment are going to be coming here anyways. Except for like the few I keep in my closet in my bedroom and the new unboxed ones that I'm keeping in my mom's closet. Now next time I also am going to have to start looking into getting a small plastic drawer for some of the globes maybe. Or just some, or just like some bins to store some like the screwdrivers or parts and such. What I really want to try to do is um, get this shelf completed though, so that way I can move some of the glassware over there. Because the glassware that's on here at the moment um, is only just here just until I can find another spot to put them. Because I do want to use this top shelf on this one for fan motors as well. Because having some fan stuff over on the top shelf of that one definitely makes a big difference compared to having them on the bottom one instead. So there's really not much more I can do in terms of the stuff here because I don't really have anywhere else to put them until I get that last shelf over here. So the next video is just gonna be when I get that next shelf, assembling it and moving the stuff there and that way I can clear up the space even more. So yeah, let me go ahead and kill the power and um, shut off the lights so I can head home. And um, yeah, that'll be it for this video. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoy and stay tuned for more videos to come.